one of the upcoming sets, Battle Partners, which is uh, going to be a Japanese set released in January. And we don't know what the English one's going to be called, but uh, we just got some news from Poke Beach, and they're talking about um, where does it say right here um, that we're going to get owner or trainer Pokemon again. Um, so we have some examples um, down here. Now, I think this is very, very exciting on the heels of the Team Rocket Returns news. Um, for vintage cards, these are some of my favorites of all time. And like the Misty's Gyarados, the Team Aqua's Kyogre, Rocket's Mewtwo, like these are great examples. Um, let's, we'll just jump into uh, like some of my favorites. We'll just talk about some of the vintage um, cards. And if you guys are looking at these, um, first off, just real quick, uh, I'm a wee bit under the weather, so this video might be short and I don't feel good. If my voice sounds off. I do apologize. But I do think that this is important um, because I think that a lot of these cards um, are some of the best artworks that we got of a lot of these Pokemon. Um, and I stand by that. There are they are really good and they're some of my favorites. So I would expect to see really, really great artworks coming from this set. Um not necessarily like vintage like I would lift I just want to see this with like the newer Pokemon. Um and some vintage thrown in, like some OGs, um, would be really cool. But the artwork on these ones was just so different, um, at the time. So full art versions of all of these, like Obviously, Blaine's Charizard is iconic, and Blaine's Arcanine, um, Erica's Venusaur. I think Misty's Gyarados might be my favorite here. Um, I also like Giovanni's Gyarados. I like how they had two two Gyaradoses from the set. Um, we touched on the Mewtwo, like Sabrina's Alakazam, like, and then okay, obviously we'll pull this one up. Sabrina's Gengar here is a really cool card. Um, full art of this would be cool, so that is really exciting. Um, let me know in the comments, like, if you guys are excited to see, like, f potential full art cards of, I don't know. It's just when I get so excited when I start to think of, like, what this could mean. I think, I hope they do it justice. I think they will. Super excited. Like, these next sets are just going to be crazy. Um, let's jump into page two right here and see. Um, okay, so this is where these cards are worth a lot less, but I just... I really like even some of these arts. Um, Erica's Bulbasaur and Ivysaur, they're too good. The Pikachu, right? And that's kind of where it ends, um, to be honest. But all of these alternate style artworks are just chef's kiss. And then there's another set um, that I wanted to talk about. Um, Gym Heroes, which is not, it's not as good, I wouldn't say. But there's still a lot of great looking cards from this set you get a lot of these uh trainer cards which are cool but um the sabrina's gengar and the blaine's moltres um are definitely some of my favorites from this uh from this era i just the nostalgia factor of doing the trainers cards i think for me it's just gonna be it's it's gonna get me so excited i already am um also like Rocket Scyther was one of my favorite cards. I think I had a Japanese um, one of this growing up. But, yeah, I just... So we don't know exactly what this is, what this means as of yet, as far as, like, what, what trainers, right? I would assume, if I had to speculate, that this is going to be from all the Scarlet and Violet. Um, it did mention in the article that we're getting like a Marnie's, more Peko and stuff. So I'd expect it for it to be mainly focused on new stuff, uh, which would make sense. And I still think could be done amazing. So I wouldn't expect it to, to be too vintage heavy, but it is, it is possible. Um, so yeah, I'm just either way, even if it's only new Pokemon and new trainers, it's totally totally fine like it's about time that pokemon got back to this it's been too long um yeah so that's gonna do it for this one guys i do apologize for the shorter video um yeah i am under the weather not feeling well but i just wanted to touch on 
this little piece of news real quick. Um, I'll still make a video tomorrow, even if I'm not feeling good again. But uh, I appreciate all you guys uh, watching. Uh, leave me a comment below um, if you guys are excited for this set. Um, yeah, sorry. I'm rambling. Um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. And remember, it was never a phase.